There's the traditional image of the leather clad biker, and there is or was a valid reason for wearing leather in that it offers very good abrasion and wind protection. It is literally a second skin. However, textile technology has advanced in recent years to the point where man-made fibres can outperform animal skin. Safety experts say that many lives have been saved over the last 10 years that can be directly attributed to these technical advances. Man-made textiles are better than leather at keeping the rain out and the heat in, as well as offering abrasion resistance. As for thermal efficiency, it may surprise you to know that you can lose up to 600 calories an hour riding a bike in the winter. Great if you're on a diet, but not so good for your levels of concentration. So, what should you look for when buying protective gear? Well, ideally, the jacket and trousers should be multi-layered. This allows you to adjust your heat retention by adding or removing the layers to suit the conditions. Also, expect some elbow, shoulder and knee armour. It should be CE Mark and could well be a recognised brand such as Knox. Some jackets have the new D30 armour, which is flexible in its natural state but stiffens on impact. Finally, a little tip. When trying on the trousers, you might think the armour is too low down on the shin. It's designed like that so as to end up in the right place in the event of an accident.